All right, everybody, let's get to the grits and gravy because you guys deserve it. And we've been hearing the truth from you guys. Reddit, Instagram, YouTube, you've been very harsh to us and we deserve that because we haven't given you the answers. Yeah, we moved out of Compton and yes, DDE subleased our building while we look for a new building. That doesn't mean the times are ending. That doesn't mean Hoonigan is dead. You guys may be wondering, since you're not in the old Compton building, what can we expect? Fresh new collabs. Hello, everyone. Hakone Toge in Japan. We are out here in Aspen, Colorado. I have watched you for so long. New content. <laughs> Live events. I'm still gonna be involved in these projects. <laughs> Jim Connor, old faces. Still gonna show up. Still gonna be in some of their content. I'm still working with Hoonigan on a couple projects. We will make some future content together. But you're still gonna see my mug on camera. And even some new faces. You might wanna stick around for this because 2024 is just starting and we want you guys on board. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another episode of This Versus That. And today, we've got a very special guest host, Mr. Doug Gamero. Hey everyone, it's this versus that. Did it. Yeah, let's go. All right, let's go this. I'm Doug, and today we have this Porsche Taycan Turbo, and we have Will, who has brought it out here with us. Yes. Will, please tell us about your Porsche. It's a 2020 Taycan Turbo. It's basically factory spec. It's just got a wrap on it. A 616 horsepower and right. Factory spec up. is pretty strong to begin with. 616 right. horsepower, all-wheel drive. Correct. Tell us about the wrap. Uh, so my wife actually designed it. It's a two-tone wrap. Covers the uh, kind of eye-catching as it can be, right? Aside from the wrap, is it completely? There is nothing aftermarket on this car except the wrap. Okay, so yeah, the wheels. So 21 inch Mission E wheels, yes. which are the cool wheels. They were the ones from the concept oh, car, the cool and we actually brought them out. How long have you had your uh, Taycan? So we've had it for a little over a year now. Yeah. And it's uh, it's just been amazing. You're an EV enthusiast. Yes, sir. What do you think about this compared to other electric cars? It's all Porsche. Yeah. So um, as far as from a driving dynamics, it's Porsche. It's fantastic. Right, in terms of handling and steering, in addition to just being fast and a Right, and again, it, it drives like a Porsche. So it's right. everything is perfect. So what do you get going on in the interior? So black on black, traditional um, sport. It does have all the touch screens. You got all the driving screen, modes, screen, chassis screen. height, you know, electric sport sound, which is very cool. You got yes. a launch control? It does have launch control. And you're gonna be using it? I will be using it. And you have no qualms about just doing run after run in this thing? No, so I've actually dragged this a couple different times and there is no loss of power over and over and over and over again. Do you notice the difference when it's fully charged versus not? Or? Honestly, no, it, it really, it's, the same, it's the same hit every single time. Interesting. Okay, well this thing is awesome. Uh, now it's time to check out the other car. Ladies and gentlemen, someone very special, all the way from Russia, Timon. If you don't know Timon, I'll give you a little history lesson. Helped start the Russian Drift Series. Yeah, 15 years ago. You're an OG yeah. driving a G-body. Yeah. Kinda. Yeah. <laughs> So tell me a little bit about your car. Uh, so uh, I have a body. I was on a container for the 10 years. Every time I come to my garage, I see it on Just container. And I, it's so beautiful body. I need to do something with it. I have a Toyota Chaser. I decided to do the Chaser with the body of Monte Carlo. So this car is a JZX100 yeah. chassis. Yeah, it's just the body put it on, on the top. chassis, yeah. Dang.
on your engine, you said around 700 horsepower. Yeah, about. And for people who don't know, this is a 2JZ or a 1JZ? No, no, it's an original 2JZ. Mm. It's all stock engine. Head gasket, studs, nothing? Nothing. This engine actually from my S14 and the transmission, Samsonas transmission, S14. You have a Samsonas in this? Yeah. What are these wheels? Uh, original Japanese, you know, race wheels, but it's 18s. And uh, for this race, I I don't have, you know, drag tires. So I put the 18 the Toyo Proxes, that's all, that's all I have. Yeah, <laughs> R888 275, that's a big tire. It almost looks like you have two handbrakes, but I know that you don't, but explain that. So this handbrakes, it's like custom made. You can adjust anything you want. You can adjust the height, you can adjust the angle. Oh yeah? Uh, and also, yeah, so now it works like normal handbrakes. But if I want to park brake, it has a parking brake. Dude, that's Car pretty stands, rad. Yeah. And right next to it, what's that? Yeah. So this is a sequential gearbox, they call Samsonas. I use it for many years. Well, I think that's gonna come in handy today because you got your work cut out for you, but I'm excited to see what you got. I think that the Taycan will win. I don't like it, <laughs> but it's probably gonna win. The Monte Carlo will do it in a much, it will lose in a spectacular fashion. I'm going with the Monte Carlo. They look like they have a sense of humor, so they must know how to party. You really just don't want to bet against Russians. Like they're the bad guy in every movie and they're probably gonna be the bad guy today, which means that they're gonna win. So I'm going with the god dang Monte Carlo. I mean, I think it's pretty obvious I'm gonna go with the G-Body, even though it's not really a G-Body on the inside. All right, you guys know how this goes. If you don't, you probably should watch an episode or two, but it's heads up to a thousand with this G-Body, this Porsche, and uh, everybody else, so. Round one. He's gonna give him, give him 10 cars. Cody, you didn't let him. 10. 10 cars. Cody, this is your fault. Bro, no, he no, ran out fault. of gear already. 10, just give him 10, 10 otherwise we know what's gonna happen. Man, <laughs> hey, you're doing a hell of a job though. You, you, don't, you know what, like pedaling, having to shift, you know, you're driving great. Just the unfortunate thing is- Yeah, but no grief, guys. It's... Did you run out of gear too? Yeah? Yeah. Yeah? So here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna give you 10 cars and we're gonna see if that thing can catch you. That's cool. Okay, <laughs> perfect. All right, so you know, we are here about, you know, being fair and what have you, right? True. So uh, we're gonna give him 10 cars and see if you can catch it. 10 cars will work, I guess. Okay. Okay, so here's the deal. We're gonna give the G-Body 10 cars uh, and we're gonna see if the Taycan can catch it. Obviously, we all know what happens with these EVs. You know what, we wanna see a race. So. Let's put that thing to the ringer. Round two. Antelope in the wild. Good job on that gap call. Yeah. Tired of these <laughs> EV cars beating know, right? everything. So what do we what do we give them? Like what do we is there anything we, we give them a Bible to tell that motherfucker? Let's, let's get an update here. Was it? Who won? Oh damn it! Here, show them. Damn. It's like it's not oh. terrible. 
freaking yeah, right. One more car. Ooh. We go roll and start. I think it's a Rolling. big Roll start. Roll start. Roll start. Roll start. So, you run out of gear pretty, you only have four speeds? No, no, I put the fourth gear on the finish. Oh, okay. Do you want to try a roll race? Yeah, so, yeah. roll race would be both of you guys going at the ah, same yeah, speed. Yeah. And then we can going. try, we can try, yeah? yeah? I already have nothing left to lose. Bonus round. Porsche one, yes, we know that, but we're gonna yeah. let the G body have a little bit of fun back there. Ain't no sense of bringing a drift car if it ain't gonna do some drift car stuff. Shoot on him! No! Yeah. That boy was sandbagging for sure. Mm -hmm.